converting area. That is, how do you change one square foot into square inches? Perhaps you already know that there are 144 square inches in one square foot. How many square feet are in one square yard? Perhaps you already know that there are 9 square feet in one square yard. If you already knew that there are 144 square inches in one square foot, and you already knew that there were 9 square feet in one square yard, then you are well on your way to having a simple tool or model that will help you solve the most difficult of area conversion problems. The reason that there are 9 square feet in one square yard is because one square yard is the same thing as 3 feet by 3 feet. A quick overview for you. Area is a two-dimensional figure or length multiplied in directions 90 degrees to each other. Width times height is area. Length times width is area. Length times width equals area. Length, width equals area. One square yard is one yard by one yard. But how do you convert one type of area to another type of area? Once you know the trick, you will be able to work even the most difficult of problems because no problem will be too difficult for you. Simply convert the links of the two different directions to the units that you want your final answer to be. For example, if you want the final answer to be in square feet, convert the links to feet and then multiply. One yard by one yard. Convert those to 3 feet by 3 feet. Then multiply. If you have a problem that measures 3 meters by 5 feet and you want the answers in square inches, then think about how you would solve this. Don't try to solve the problem for an answer, but think about how you should solve the problem. three meters, five feet, how many square inches? Convert the meters to inches, convert the feet to inches, then multiply inches by inches. Just how you convert one length to another length is beyond the scope of this lesson. If you are watching this on YouTube, the link to the lesson on length conversion is in the comments section below. Your comments, questions, and suggestions are welcome, encouraged, and always appreciated. You may write to me at alanmorris at yahoo.com.